Hey everybody, it's Kyle. I'm here at Screenburn with Heather. She works for Capcom. She's going to let us know what's going on and what they brought with them. Heather, what did you bring to set Screenburn this weekend? Uh, for opening weekend Screenburn, we brought Resident Evil Mercenaries coming for the 3DS. We have Super Street Fighter 4 3D Edition, also for the 3DS. It's a launch title for the 3DS. And we have Okamiden for the DS coming out on Tuesday, March 15th. Excellent. Uh, what makes uh, Super Street Fighter 4 for the 3DS unique? How did you take advantage of the 3D effect and implement that? So Super Street Fighter 4 3D Edition takes the console version and it perfects it for the 3DS. Uh, in order to do that, you have a really new depth of field, you have an over-the-shoulder dynamic camera, you have global Wi-Fi play, and uh, you also have something called Street Pass, where when the units are closed, the two 3DS units, you're, you have figurines that will actually fight one another. It's a pretty cool feature. Excellent. What about uh, Resident Evil? What makes that new and unique to develop for the 3DS? Well, you know, if you know anything about Resident Evil, you have zombies and scary things coming out at you. So if you can imagine in 3D, that's just really ups that factor. So don't, I don't know, you might be careful if you're playing at night, lights are off. Uh, but in, in Resident Evil The Mercenaries, you're playing a mode from Resident Evil 5 um, in which you have actually some fan favorite characters and it's a lot of run and gun action. All right, awesome. Um, what Are there other games in the works for the 3DS? Is anything coming out soon, later? What's going on with that? Yes, we have uh, Resident Evil Revelations coming out for the 3DS as well as Mega Man Legends 3 coming out for the 3DS. Are there any unique challenges developing for the 3D system that you know about? Yeah, in working with the Super Street Fighter uh, 3D Edition team, um, Onasan, the producer, had talked about taking that core gameplay and then what they have to do, the developers, is they have to really um, take into account that X and Y, basically the depth perception. And it takes a lot of hand tuning and fine tweaks to make sure it really looks good on the 3DS system. Uh, we're already getting a great reception to the game, very good review scores, and it comes out at the end of the month. So we're very excited for the fans to try this out and tell us what they think. All right, now i got to ask you, what's the likelihood we're going to see Phoenix Wright in 3D anytime soon? Well, you know, if you want it, you just have to let us know, and uh, we'll definitely, we listen to the fans, so. You heard her, folks. Start objecting now, and get a sidebar, and I don't know lawyer jargon. I should play more Phoenix, right?